Africa's gift to its tribe. Homegrown Radio, Ekahaya, my home. Welcome back. I am your host, KK. You are still tuned into the Homegrown Unplugged. This is a space for spoken word, creativity, and homegrown talent. This is dedicated to each and everyone out there who dares to dream. D R E A M and an S. Here goes. Dreams. These are designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. This is a land where your imagination takes over and as a child you become so timid, so unreliably, and I mean vulnerable. Dreams designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. A world without dreams is like taking a seed and planting it in a soil that is filled with snow and thick as ice. See, when you dream, you close your eyes and doze off to wonderland. This is where pictures and still images cement and lament themselves into frames of the mind to carry what you think tomorrow is what holds for you today. It was just to keep one's mind to say, you keep going, and if you dream, you will definitely keep going. Without a dream, then you are holding on to just a frame with nothing. But when you dream, you will fall and you will still rise. You will fall and you will still rise. So dreams was just written to motivate each and everyone who feels like, I can't do it today. Dreams are what is carried from the past and carried through to the future. Yes, you opened up those doors and see into the future. Now, if you don't dream, then you have never encountered an eagle. Dreams, these are designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. See, someone who dares not to dream, it is like simply attempting to fly with broken wings. Yes, that bird in that meany nest that was left by its parents. Dreams designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. This poem was simply written to motivate people. Because you know when you are out there always pushing, there's always th those people that always nibble on you and they just ask you, Guti, Ah, but if you are a best student at school, they'll ask you, how do you do it? How, do you, how are you always best student? How do you keep motivated? So this is what motivated this poem. See, as children, we used to adopt what we thought they were dreams and thoughts of people that are around us. Well, those were fractured thought. Now, these are dreams. They are designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. And if you dare not to dream, well, keep sleeping because tomorrow is not guaranteed for you. I dare you to dream. And thank God I witness my eyes just into your face to just see those thousand stories of untold dreams. And I mean designed to raise epitomes of ambiotrophic minds. Dear child, dream. Design to raise epitomes of an ambiotrophic mind. Mind, dreams. Thank you.